Last and final news is a cleric was arrested for selling meth to students, saying it'll help stu- them study Quran better. Hey. Uh, yeah. And I've- recite Quran better. According to The Star, a religious leader from Madura, Northeast Java in Indonesia, had been selling the drug to his students at an Islamic boarding school and had reasoned it was permissible under Islamic law. Being an avid drug user himself, Ahmad Marzuki managed to avoid the police for two months after they learned of his actions. What? Despite being a fugitive, the religious leader still taught at other Islamic boarding schools in Serbia and Mojokerto cities. So, yeah, apparently he's a drug addict. And Wait, how did he how... avoid the police? Like, even though they found it? That? doesn't say. It just says that he was able to avoid them and was still teaching at other schools. So... Yeah, I don't know. He, he said, like, I think instead of saying it helps you read the Quran, he should have said, like, why would you want to read the Quran? Why would you want to read God's book when you can meet God? Right? <laughs> <laughs> Talk to him directly. Like, I don't know. That would be more of a LSD. Well, or what I'm gleaning from this is that because he's a drug addict, he needs money to buy his drugs and he needs drugs, so he's selling the drugs to his students to feed his own habit. Right. That's what it seems like to me because it said that um, they captured him. Oh, listen to this, Armin. He was captured. The authorities finally managed to capture him while he was attending a funeral. (laughs) Right. Wow. By the way, it shows how much these students value studying the Quran that that had to be a marketing pitch, right? Like, right? So, imagine, <laughs> like imagine like <laughs> that being your selling point. You're like the guy, the students are like, I don't know, man, this is wrong, and I sh- I don't think I should do math. It's like ah, uh, I like, but it will help you with your Quran studies. Oh well, why didn't you say so? <laughs> <laughs> you should have just started with that. Like you, okay, give it to me, like. How much these students value their Quran studies that that was a marketing, that that was a line to be used. But uh, yeah. And also the Indonesia's largest independent Islamic organization said that while the Quran does not explicitly mention the drug, <laughs> being meth, the religious text verses should be interpreted with a consensus among Islamic scholars that there is no... Um, no drug use in uh, the Quran, and but the the guy who was selling meth said he knew it was illegal, but he found no evidence against it in the Quran. And that guy's like, "Well, yeah, it doesn't explicitly mention meth in the Quran." Right. So yeah, so neither in the Quran or the Hadith is there anything against like drug use. However, here's a trick, okay? See, I know how to do BS in in religion. I speak religion, okay? So if you really wanted to like make drugs on Islamic, all you have to do is be like, okay, so when God said don't drink alcohol, you, the way you have to read that is not that the alcohol is bad. You have to look at the spirit of that order, right? This, just like in the law, they look at the spirit of the law to see what the purpose is. So God is basically saying, don't drink anything. Don't do it. Don't consume anything that alters your mind, right? So in that way, drugs will also be bad. But then you will get, then coffee will also be out of order. So that's, you, you're going to lose coffee if you do that. Anyways. But you can't lose coffee or tea you, in yeah, the that would be too Islamic much. countries. That would be too much. <laughs> um, so the top comment is saying, I'm sure it would help them study better. You would have to be as high as an in 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 a bre- well, how do you read this as inebriated? inebriated mongoose to believe that shit um well to be fair that people that do quranic studies they have no idea what they're reading right they just like they just go like this they put their head back and forward and they're just reading the text and these the where is this? pakistan right right so, uh indonesia oh indonesia sorry so they don't even speak arabic they're just following the words they have no idea what's in the Quran. They, some of them even me- have memorized the Quran cover to cover. Uh, and if you just name them, a, give them a surah, number and verse, they would just recite it. And then ask them, what, w- what was the meaning of what you just recited? And they have no clue. So 99% of these people have no idea what they're reading. Anyways, 
Um, that was our last. Ali, did you want to add anything to this? No. Nope. No. Nope. All right. I wanted to say something that I think is interesting. Um, that so these guys were taking meth to study better, but you have tons of American college students who take Adderall or Ritalin, which is are basically stimulants. They're not meth, but yeah. they're in the amphetamine family, which methamphetamine is to study better as well. It's so an, it's not an unfounded concept. It's not, but students. I do, I think it's the wrong drug. Shouldn't they? Isn't the cocaine like the drug for like studying? Uh, no, I think it's Adderall because it's supposedly no, no, like, but, but the illegal ones, like, I don't think, oh. meth, I don't think meth actually helps you with your studies. I think, I don't think it probably, does the, by the way, there's just legal, legal mumbo jumbo guys, like, don't do anything illegal. I wasn't recommending you guys to do any drugs for your studies, I was just talking about what people say and. I'm not. It's anecdotal. I'm, I'm not advocating for any drug use. Drugs are bad. Stay away from drugs. <laughs> don't don't break. I'm not advocating for breaking the law. Please don't sue me or anything. YouTube. I wasn't advocating. Hey, gods of YouTube. I'm gonna get myself in trouble. Okay. So never mind. Just forget everything I just said about cocaine. Okay. Forget it. Forget it. <laughs> drugs are bad. Okay. Strike it from the record. Yes, yes. All right. Love you guys. Thank you, everybody. In Bye. The Bye. <laughs> Thank you, Angel, Old Scratch, Chris, uh, Chrissy, uh, Vibrantly, who, let me see, um, Kendall, George, Mickey, Jess, Josh, uh, Old Scratch, I think I read, Rail, of, um, yeah, another godless atheist. Sorry if I didn't read your name. I still love you. If I didn't read your name, I was in, it wasn't on purpose. Beach was here too as well. Mike, I think, was here. Anyway, see you guys again next week. Thank you for your comments. Share the video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Subscribe now. Do it now. Subscribe and share. Share the video and hit the bell <laughs> button. Hit that bell thingy. Bell thingy. Hit it. Okay, please come on. You like you watch all all the way to here. You must like our content, so you might as well subscribe. All right, and sharing is caring. Bye. 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 Atheists are under attack in many places. If they were Christians, their voices would be heard. If they were Jews, their voices would be heard. If they were Muslims, their voices would be heard. But they are atheists, and not many seem to be listening. Let's make it difficult for them to ignore us. We have built a global community, and now we are tearing down geographic, cultural, and language barriers so we can find each other and support each other. In the last decade, we have built the largest atheist community in the world. Now we are doing the same in other languages. With your help, we have started Atheist Republic in Persian and Arabic. انضميت مؤخرا لأسرة Atheist Republic وحيصير عندي بودكاست باللغة العربية. As we grow, we can dedicate more time, staff, and resources to start doing the same in Spanish, Portuguese, Malay, Bengali, Urdu, Hindi, and other languages. We are providing community, support, informative content, and amplifying the voices of those who need protection, especially in countries where people feel isolated simply for their lack of belief. We want to be there for them, and we are only getting started. Help us get there. Check in the description for ways you can support our projects.